Today we're here in Houston, Texas. We'll be sitting down with Dr. Jonathan Clavel, who's a private practice urologist at Clavel Urology. We'll also get to meet one of his patients, Richard, and Richard's wife, Maria. We're gonna hear their special story about their journey as a couple through erectile dysfunction. We're gonna learn about the emotional recovery after prosthetic surgery and all that it entails. I'm married to Maria. We meet through a mutual friend. I mean, we clicked from the beginning, like, where have you been all my life? And we dated for a week and so, and then I moved in with him. <laughs> <laughs> kind of, everything went fast. I love her, so I'm not regretting anything now. It was the beginning of something, the most beautiful thing I've ever had in my life, so, yeah. I hired it for years. Even to Maria, I didn't tell her nothing at the beginning. I was kind of afraid that she go away because I have ED. I think I was on my 30s, uh, start early. I was taking pills without she, she even know, and it was working fine. We were having sex almost every day, and everything was perfect. But then pills sometimes, though, at the beginning work, but then been a lot of years, so I stopped working. All of a sudden, two years into the relationship, it's like, I want to be intimate with you. And he's like, oh, I'm tired. Oh, I had a long day, you know. We went out, we did this, we did that. I'm too tired. And I'm like, this doesn't sound like a, a happy, a happy man. So I sat down with him and I told him, I need you to tell me what's going on. And that's when he told me about his problem. And I was like, we could work through this. That's when I start seeing doctors. So my regular doctor, he sent me to urology. They give me like electricity therapy. That thing doesn't work, so I went to see a, like a natural doctor. They give me some natural pills and stuff like that, give me shots. And uh, I think I was doing a lot of stuff to make it work, but it wasn't working the way I want to. It make me more stressed, I was sad. I, said, I don't know what to do now. He was desperate to find something, a cure for his problem. And I know that had to be painful, having to hide and wanting to do something for, like, for yourself and you can't because you don't have, you know, like, the options, you don't know anything. I was seeing three or four doctors. I didn't see no answer. And I said, I want to get it done, but I want to get it done with the right doctor because I want to make it work. And that's when I found Dr. Clavel. Why? Two men have to go through this entirely painful process of failure over failure over failure when we have something that can actually solve the problem for them. Richard was a young man with really no medical comorbidities. He was a pretty healthy guy. However, he had erectile dysfunction for many years. We did the penile Doppler duplex ultrasound and he did have problems with the blood flow getting into the penis. So he did have a physical problem that was just localized to his penis. When once we started chatting, that's when I started, you know, noticing a change in his demeanor. I think this is it. I think I just found now what I need. Once he got like the whole information and he said, I'm going to go through with it. I mean, you saw it. It was a drastic change for him. The emotional recovery of Richard actually started the day of the surgery. Before I even, you know, got him into the operating room, you could tell he was like high-fiving me. You know, he's like, hey doc, I'm excited about this. He felt worthless. Now he feels worthy of a relationship. Now uh, he felt hopeless. Now he's hopeful. The first time we were intimate after that, it was like, wow. So how does it work again? Where is it again? Because it was like nothing. Like he didn't have anything. It was just completely normal. It was, I mean, um, I was amazed. I don't have no more stress anymore about it because now I'm, I know 100% it worked. And now I can say like I can be with her the rest of my life. The biggest benefit that most men get out of this surgery is actually how their emotional health can actually improve. That's what reminds me of why I got into this field. There's many doctors that focus on adding years to a patient's life. 
My goal as a men's sexual health specialist and with you know, penile implant surgery is we want to add life to your years. One thing that's exciting when it comes to penile implant therapy and the fact that I'm young, right, I'm a young surgeon, is the fact that I will be there for when technology continues to improve. When I think back to what has happened in the past 10, 15, 20 years and where we are right now, the only thing that I can think of is like, I'm excited about what the future holds for PL implants. I really enjoyed meeting Dr. Clavel. He emphasized the importance of owning the responsibility that we have as urologists. We can take away that physical roadblock and open up that emotional recovery and restore the spontaneity of youth and love. I really wanna thank Dr. Clavel for having us today. It's been a pleasure. Thank you for opening up your office to us. Thank you so much to Richard and Maria for opening up your hearts to us and sharing your story. That's gonna help so many others. It's been so eye-opening for me to see just how real the pain of erectile dysfunction is. It's a fight, a struggle to understand and to take action. We've heard time and time again how inflatable penile prosthetic surgery has restored confidence, hope, and intimacy. Many relationships have found a new vibrancy after IPP surgery. For physicians, we hope that hearing these stories gives you the tools you need to recognize the early signs and symptoms of erectile dysfunction and refer your patients to appropriate specialists. For patients, we hope that these stories give you the confidence to be your own advocate and feel empowered to go out and seek the care that you need. Maybe by seeing a little piece of yourself in these patients, you can avoid their same struggles and get the care that you need faster. We can solve ED together. Now let's get to work 